Happy Monday, YouTube. Master Trifecta here, hanging out the house. Just checked the mail and got some really cool TTNs in. And one I was going to bust on camera because I thought it was pretty cool. But yeah, I got it just because today from Trev BC9. Trev BC9, keep it trill. He gave me a just because. He just moved out of his folks' house. Just graduated high school, off to college. Trev works at the arena there in Tulsa and was able to hook me up with this Skylar Diggins auto signed photo 4x6. Sky Dig, what up, girl? Fucking, that's awesome. Wasn't expecting that, so huge shout out to him. Give him a follow on Twitter at TrevBC9. I'll put his info down in the description down below. Um, I also got a pretty interesting uh, TTM return back today from uh, Kevin Smith. I got my cards returned back unsigned. And got like this is like this is the first time I ever got a form letter back. It feels like, but it just says, uh, "Dear Trent, unfortunately, Kevin cannot sign individual requests on these cards. He's contracted to sign a specific number with Tops, and those are put in random boxes of cards for lucky purchasers to find. Due to the commitment, Kevin cannot fulfill additional requests for free signatures on these cards. On behalf of Kevin, thank you so much for your support and your kind words in your letter." Sincerely, View Askew Productions. So that's some boo-boo. He should be cooler to his fans than that. He's the only guy that... And this looks like one of the cards got nicked up in the process, too. So maybe there's like a card show. If you know of any uh, Kevin Smith viewings in your area, like uh, meet and greets or anything, give me a shout because I'd definitely love to get a couple of those cards signed. Uh, but the one that I wanted to open on camera today, there's huge potential for this. I hope it's alive. Let me go ahead and pop the top. Because as, sh as I show you the return, you guys are probably going to recognize the return address from one of my earlier vids. Because uh, this is coming from Mino Mine Productions out of Lake Mary, Florida. left in there. So yeah, this is going to be, this will be interesting. I'm so nervous. I've just clambered up real quick. Am I ever going to get this open? There is so much tape on this bag. This is crazy. What is the problem here? Okay, here's what's causing the problem. This is the worst reveal video ever. Holy shit. Oh, wow. He did. He signed it. Please don't say that's on the plastic. Please say that's the comic book. Boom. It's the comic book. Now there's many questions on the whether this is a legitimate auto or not, but this is a steel number one issue signed by Shaquille O'Neal. Um, this past week at a card show, JSA BGS was there, and I went ahead and submitted that other Shaquille O'Neal to JSA, so we'll know in like a month or two whether that's a legit auto. But the reason why I resent this was because I was looking on... Uh, the TTM manager on, uh, I think it's sportscardforum.com. And so there were so many people that were pretty much thinking that they were authentic autographs. So we'll know for sure whether this is legit, but if so, that's freaking awesome. Shaquille O'Neal on steel number one. That is so freaking awesome. I also sent one more thing, and I'll be interested to see if I get it back, too. I sent it separately a couple days later from this one. So there might be another return on its way. I don't know, but... Wow, that's freaking awesome. Great day for the mailbox. More as it develops. Take it easy, guys. Peace.